Hello, I am going to show you how to put a TI-84 graphing calculator on your Android phone. As of July 2021, this is not available for iPhones, but the iStore, there is an app called Calc84. I, that's free and I would recommend that. But for Android users, you are in luck. Let me show you what you need to do. So let's go to the Play Store. And I'm going to search for an app called Wabbit. Okay. When you start to type it in, there it is. It's a picture of a calculator with a little rabbit in front of it. I'm going to go ahead and hit that. And you can see there's one of four different calculators you can use here. All right. This one on the far right looks very similar to the black calculator that we use, or the dark gray or navy blue, whatever, in the classroom, the TI-84+. Plus. No one uses a TI-83 in high school, but I like that they show you a picture of, it looks like Zelda. Um, this one, the TI-84 Plus Silver Edition, is very similar to the yellow one that they use in schools. You'll notice that the buttons and everything is the same. The only difference is the color of the calculator literally behind the buttons. Now, these are nice, but I'm going to suggest that you put in the TI-84 Plus C silver edition. Why am I going to suggest the C? The C is for color. When you graph two lines, you can make them different colors so you can really see the difference in the functions that you graph. On top of that, this screen is very monochromatic, like grays and blacks. It's really dull. This screen pops. It's a little bit nicer. It looks nicer. It looks more advanced technologically. And don't worry about the red background on the calculator behind the buttons because I will show you how you can change it to any color you would like. So let's install this. And as I said, this is only available on Android phones. The phone I am currently using is about four years old. So uh, it's the year 2021 and I have an S7 Edge. Okay, so this works with mine. You would really have to have an old old version of Android for it not to work, okay? So let's open this up. And when I open this up, yes, let's allow Wabbit access to all the stuff. You're gonna see the screen here, okay? Uh, you have two options. I already have a ROM, or help me create a ROM using an open source software. What is a ROM? A ROM is basically the skin of the calculator. It's the picture of the calculator you wanna use. Chances are you do not have that on your phone already. So we're gonna select help me create a ROM using open source software and hit next at the bottom. Now here's where you can pick whatever calculator you want. If you want the Navy one, it's the TI-84 Plus. If you want the one that looks yellow or you can change it to any background, but it still has that gray screen, you pick this one. But if you want the one that has the colored lines, it's exactly the same, except it looks fresher and new and clean. What I would suggest is a TI-84 Plus C. And that's what I'm gonna get. So let's select that and hit next. Oh, ABC mouse, how nice. All right, it's loading the OS version. And I apologize that I have 4G and not 5G speed here, children. I really am sorry. Do, 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 do. Ba, da, 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 da. This may take a while, obviously. All right. Again, I'm gonna say this one more time. For all of you that have friends with iPhones, okay, you want the Calc 84. Now look what pops up. You can kind of see the, the, the calculator in the background over here. They automatically bring up the, the menu. All I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go from right to left and push that back. And there you go, there's your calculator. If I want that menu to come back up, I slide left to right, okay? Boop, there you go. Now, for some odd reason, let's say you get this calculator and you don't want the TI-84 plus C, you want the other one, you come back here and you can just rerun your setup wizard and it'll bring you back to that ROM menu where you find one and so forth, all right? So, how do I change? The gray is nice. The gray is nice because I can see the blue letters above each one of the buttons, okay? But let's say I wanna change that from gray to a yellow, or in my case, my favorite color is green. I'm gonna to go to settings. 
and you'll see skin right here. Okay, I'm going to hit that, and now it gives you the whole color palette to pick from. I'm going to slide to the green somewhere down here. Ooh, yeah, nice green. Let's go somewhere with a little bit darker green. And now when I hit the back arrow on my phone, there you go, it's green. That is cool. And why do I like this better? If I graph two things, you can see whatever I type into Y1 is going to be blue. Let's call that, I don't know, X squared minus 4. And whatever I type in, uh, type in Y2 when it graphs, it will graph red. Okay, let's do negative X plus 4. Right, and when I graph these, just having a clean, crisp screen to look at that shows you the different colors of the two lines that to me is worth a million, uh, worth a million bucks. It's so much better. And again, uh, you can choose the color of the calculator for anything you want. 